YouTube. Thanks for tuning in to the Cecil Spivey channel. Uh, today I'm just gonna make a short video highlighting my redneck uh, home brewing sink. Uh, so let's take a look at that. All right, here we are. This is my uh, redneck homebrew sink. And uh, you've seen that on some of my previous videos. Uh, I showed uh, on one brew day where I had to uh, rig up this hose down here to the bottom where the uh, uh, the sink drain is and that drains out onto the ground uh, you know just uh, runs it away from my brewing area uh, so that I don't have tons of water everywhere uh, and there's my stand but here's the thing I was using a, a hose uh, and just had a little clamp that I would clamp it onto the side or hang it over to the side and it was always um, falling out you know it was hard to manage I had to use that hand uh, every time I had to run water and, and I you know couldn't use two hands to handle what I was uh, what I was working with well I used to have this uh, this kind of a setup and and uh, dismantled it several years ago when I moved but here is my uh, new faucet setup so I've got a hose coming from the uh, uh, from the faucet on the house and hooked up to this uh, piece of PVC and then uh, as you can see I've got a piece of framing there framing lumber and I've got two faucets this one here is a three-quarter inch faucet uh, and that's three-quarter inch PVC at the back and that's for maximum volume okay and then this one here is just a little half inch faucet and both of them are quarter turn uh, so easy to turn on and turn off you don't have to twist 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 and then um so i've got me a, a short piece of hose that i use for uh you know cleaning kegs and things like this and this big tub uh, you know it's old uh, water trough will uh, uh handle my big 20 gallon pot and also uh, 15 and a half gallon kegs and so uh, it's also a nice hard rubber it'll last me the rest of my life and um it's nice for even if I'm doing glass carboys for a small batch, um, you know, you don't have to worry about dinging it up in the, against the side of like a metal or, or uh, porcelain uh, sink and uh, possibly cracking or breaking your glass. Uh, so that's, that's one reason why I purposely chose this rubber trough. So let's, uh, let's try it out and see what it does. As you can see, I've got a lot of volume with that three-quarter inch, uh, three-quarter inch uh, coupler. Uh, I'm sorry, valve there. So, and what I usually did with this small one is I have a, a little adapter and just a short piece of uh, uh, oh three-eighths inch copper tubing, and I would use that for rinsing small things. Uh, and also, it was really handy for washing out uh, tubing and such. Uh, you know, I could just slip the tubing right over that piece of uh, copper. I wish I could find that thing. I'm, uh, I'm gonna have to find it before my brew day, which is coming up soon. And this is one other thing that I added. I added another outlet. Uh, I was gonna put a Y fitting there on that hose, uh, but that's just not very, not very sexy. Uh, and so I have a uh, three quarter inch ball valve and actually the, the, the T, uh, the handle was turned was right here on the top but when I tightened this little piece on uh, this threaded uh, coupler here actually tightened up more uh, and you know I don't want to loosen it up because I think it's gonna leak but anyway so that is for running to my chiller or just to a hose for hosing things down uh, but it's also three-quarter inches all the way through and of course this is a three-quarter inch hose so for maximum volume to my chiller so let's try that out a little bit. It's going to spray everywhere. Well, there we go. That's just on just a little bit. But um, that's going to work really well so that I'm not just tying up my hose, uh, to, you know, completely uh, to where I can't, you know, walk around and hose things down. And uh, I didn't want to have to connect and, and disconnect hoses from from these valves because they're specifically for my sink faucet 
so anyway you know it's uh just the little things that make it much handier to to get the job done so that's my redneck sink hope you like it i sure do